Our big sister is back and we kind of got kidnapped, but it's okay because the girls are like licking our toes and giving us fan service and everything is great now. I think there's a distinction between what our big sister is and what that snake lolly and that girl that was fighting Tenka and like the Amazonas, you know? I feel like they're separate factions and maybe our big sister's faction, even though they seem to be on the bad side, we can come to some kind of compromise, right? I don't think they're necessarily evil based on what we've seen, so maybe they're trying to tell us that, hey, Maybe they're not the bad people. Maybe we are the bad people, right? Regardless, uh, Kyoka and every one of them, they kind of know where Yuki is because uh, instinctual desires to the reward or something like that, right? I think Tenka might be getting involved too. I'm not really sure, but let's begin today's reaction. Yeah, every time she uses a power, she needs to eat the peach though. Isn't that interesting? Wait, 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 wait. You you hadn't eaten one before. Yeah, that's right. They're, they're trying to say like before when they were still together, they had they, she never ate it. She just keeps eating. We need to get a backstory. Dub peach? Can I get some dub peaches in the fucking chat? Yo, I'm glad that you guys look like this. In fact, I think these girls have better designs, right? In terms of their outfits compared to our, like, forces. I don't know. It's it's a skin-tight suit. It's it's the skin-tight suits. That's why it makes it look better, dude. All right, backstory time? Oh. Oh, hell. Big sis looks nice, but, you know, this girl right here, man. What's her name again? Naon? Naon san no, so. Wow. Wow. What kind of job did you have? Model. She used to be a model, huh? Okay, here's Naon back on Earth. Somehow got put in the Mato. Power related to the love of beauty, huh? <laughs> so, because like she, because people who eat peaches, their powers kind of reflect what their persona or what they're about. So she's like, nah. You know what I'm gonna get? I'm gonna get some like anti-aging power. So actually, I should wait until I age to eat it. Min Maxing, she's pretty smart. She's pretty smart. Okay, here's a peach. Now eat one. Are there different types of peaches? Is that a different peach? It's a normal peach, right? Oh, is that nipple necessary? Like. Straight up, like, does this add anything to the story? Anyways, nipples, okay. She's kind of kidnapped by creepy old women, uh, okay. Shrine maidens. Omnioboro. Separate faction, right? I don't think we have any ties with these people. They're a separate faction. So they like to kidnap girls that just ate a peach to do some kind of experimentation. They study Shuki and they're trying to make humanoid hybrids, right? I mean, your beautiful body's about to get even more beautiful. Wait, 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 what did you say? What? It's one theory is I call by Mato's pious, but hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I definitely didn't want to see your butt crack again. These accidents do not occur in the human world. What accident are you talking about? You mean her transformation? Mato Miasma could have caused this? I mean, even if she didn't cooperate, I feel like she's forced to. This granny's kind of sinister, man. She looks scary. So you fuck him up, then you're gonna say you're gonna cure him? The good of humanity, my ass, dude. At least they're trying to be polite, even though they're fucking assholes. You know what? If I have to go through that, I would have been like, fuck it. I, I, I would want to kill the humans too. I would too. So like, I don't understand. The peach can be eaten in the Mato world and not the... Re I don't know. But she ate it in that world. And then the peach powers, I'm not sure, but she already kind of like turned into like Shuki, huh? But like, I thought... That the grannies were doing experimentations to make her into that, but it sounds like this is a rare case. She just happens to turn into that, and the grannies saw that, and now they're doing experimentations to understand more about why she's turning into a Shuki. And she said that maybe it's the miasma, but okay, that's what's going on so far. 
Hmm? Move through object. That's right, she can do that. <laughs> this looks kind of lewd. Okay. So she went berserk too, but... So she just... She was never taken in by, like, the old Myoji people. She was just, like, fighting and struggling. Years and years. Damn. Yo, Big Sister is fucking strong. She just brute forced it. She willed it into control? Because they'll think we're enemies. This new Omyo faction just seems like the true evil people, huh? Well, I don't know if there's associations with the Omyo people and like us, right? Does our faction know about them? Maybe they just never told us. Maybe Kyoka doesn't even know. Maybe only the Supreme Commander knows, but we might be kept in the dark intentionally. I totally understand why they're doing this. I'm on their side, to be honest. What the? Uh, Kumadoji. Okay, hello. Shukis? Oh, we saw that one before, yeah? The Unihorn Shuki, yes. Unihorn Kidomaru. What's special about them? How'd you tame them? The fuck? So these girls are able to control Shuki by just being violent with them? Okay. But how? Uh, we need to come to a compromise. You can't just attack. Would they? What if the defense force is bought out by the Omyoji people, man? I feel like... I don't know. Again, who is the good people? Are we the bad people? Good and bad is very gray, you know? Who really, really knows? We don't know, but she might be aware. This is a tough spot to be in. Oh, 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 oh. We under attack? Tenka! Kyoka just kind of feel <laughs> through my legs. Wait, what did you just say? What, 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 how, how did you know? Because she's like a radar for Yuki right now, right? It seems through my, though my legs. Okay, okay. I, I, I thought, I thought it was something even more lewd. It's like through my legs, I can feel something, and it's telling me Yuki's over there. <laughs> Hmm? What kind of feeling? Boyfriend! I didn't know Tenka saw us like that. Look at Shushu. Yo, Shushu, you can't compete. I'm sorry, Shushu. I know that you want a boyfriend too, but like, Tenka is an actual woman. You know what I mean? Like, that's an actual fucking grown, grown adult that I can like, think of myself to be with. Like, Shushu, your power cut. Like, even the hair colors, right? Like, I'm sorry, Shushu fans. Look, I understand that you guys like big girls stepping on you, you know, you know, sitting on you, but Tenka's calling us a boyfriend. Okay, basically, get Yuki and get out. Oh, they got a head start on us. Five seconds, and now we can wind back. And now we know we're gonna get under attack. Easy. Alright, Yachi was pretty pretty sick. Is it the lolly one? Coco. No, don't don't hurt Coco! I feel like we're on the same side, but we're not! Alright, 2v1. Well, technically Kuma's there too. I have a feeling Himari and Yachiho will be left behind next, and then it's gonna be Kyoka and Tenka going in, right? Noun! Okay, Yachiho and Himari exactly. Yeah. Cliche. This is the most predictable trope, guys. Come on. 
きっちりとね。ナウン。ヘロー。ユキはここに。The title was after ナウン。Oh, hello, girlfriend and girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> It's already like, bye! <laughs> This is why Tenka above everyone else. Tenka is just too good, dude. Tenka's too fucking cool. She's too OP. We're going now. Bye bye. Oh my god, we're just going bye bye? What? I didn't even get to give my villain speech. I was supposed to do a monologue. What? 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 You know what the funniest thing is? Actually, actually, I, I can't say. I, I was gonna say something here was hilarious, okay? Because Tenka shows up. Hello, hello, little slave. And I thought that she could just go home here, right? She could just go home here, but Kyoka's still here, right? Bye bye. <laughs> Kyoka's going too. That's not fair. That's not fair. Actual godlike ability. Do we? Do we know what Big Sister's ability is yet? Have we seen it? I don't think I know or remember. Is it the, it's, all right, her hair does extend. But other than that, is that it? I feel like it's so unfair if like Tenka has the power of space dimension, creating fabrics in fucking space and just teleporting and using that to text. But like she controls hair. You know what I mean? This is, this is totally not fair, dude. I'm good. A uh, little, little boo-boo. I need a little boo-boo. Lick, lick me. Oh, the reward, right. In front of Tenka? The reward in front of Tenka. Well... Akeno Gokok seen high school DXT versus this. Gokok Akeno, never sucking the Issei's dragon stuff out versus this. Let, let's see it, let's see it. Three... Four in front of Tenka four you wanna join in? Here's my other finger! No shit. He didn't he, oh, 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 oh. You didn't have to do this. Tenka doesn't have to do this, right? Kyoka has to do this, right? But Tenka, she's just like volunteer. She's like, nah, not my boyfriend. I feel like you're rewarding yourself right now, Tenka. The only way this could have been better if it, this was our toes. If, 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 if there were, I mean, the last episode, we got Coco licking our toes, but like, <laughs> do you know? What if Himari and Yachi were dying while we're just fucking doing Gok Gok fan service? I, I, you tell me, how long is this supposed to last? Oh, we're done. Hello. How'd you find us? Oh! Can't hit, little bro. Talk no jutsu, come on. Yo, last time, remember how um, Big Sis was able to override Kyoka's command? I, I thought that Yuki might actually step down here, but look, 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 he's kind of standing up for himself. It didn't work, it over... Yeah, her command didn't work. Is the gok gok that strong? You know, we have more fingers, Nei-chan. You want to get in on this session too? Alright, backstory time, but we're going to skip it, right? Naon, go, go to Naon. Oh look, wholesome scene. Okay, back at home base. Oh, nee. I don't know. What's up, Nee? Now we need a pet here, like a dog or something. Nee so, nee so alone. Okay, back with Coco fight. I mean, if it works. Oh wait, she's actually trying to talk. Combo attack? Combo attack? Her powers are so cool, dude. The whole Super Saiyan aesthetic. And we skip to the Yachio fight, maybe? No, no, oh, hey, it's that girl! Just looking at them, they look totally different, huh? Right? They don't look anything like, you know, Coco, Naon, or Big Sis. So, wonder what faction they are, huh? Golden hour! Wow, Big Sis, you're so cool! 
Yachio is just trying to look cool in front of Himari, right? Ignored. Now is just watching, just staring. What? What's she? What's she thinking now? What's your plan? Wait, Tenka knew of the research, but would the Supreme Commander allow it? I mean, Big Sis is right, but we are commanders. I feel like maybe we can have a talk no jutsu. Not any slave. Little slave. He loves those chains, though. Yeah, he loves that shit. <laughs> to become this Kyoka's slave so I can become a hero. Well, I mean, if that's what it takes to be a hero, I guess he's a really cool person. Sure. How disappointed is Big Sister in us? Tenka, come on! Is there no compromise? The fuck? Just time up? The battle. Oh, the unihorn! CGI unihorn, Shuki. Wait, are we getting a cliffhanger pretty soon? No, not yet, not yet. Hello, I control space and time. Sorry, just space. I'm your sister-in-law! Let me introduce myself. We're family now, yeah. I'm the little slave's girlfriend. Tanka's making so many moves. Sister definitely didn't want to hear that, dude. She's so mad. Okay, back to Coco. Oh? Was that a kick in the fucking... Wait, where was this? Okay, okay. Ah! I'm gonna call it a cunt punch. Yo, Shushu, where you at? Yeah, there she is. Oh, this is kind of fucked up. Oh, 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 oh. Just throw it at her. Acid, sit on him. What the fuck? How'd you get out? This Kuma thing is super tanky. Kuma is invincible, and I'm slippery, but the slippery is like the healing effect, right? Is it really a bad matchup? Yo, now on Shuki, deflecting all the bullets and rotating one hand? <laughs> Where's Naon though? Naon said that she understood, right? Oh, I feel kind of bad now. I don't know. I feel conflicted, dude. Wait, why don't you finish? Okay, because... Got shot in the head. That was close. That was fucking... Okay, I, I see the whole point. Of okay, okay, I see. I see, I see. Hey! Yachio without twin tails is kind of cool, huh? One side's down, huh? Oh, shit! Wait, he might he's gonna die? That means you have to revert the time back, and then the Shuki comes also back. Oh, that's kind of fucked up, huh? How we have to, you know, save our sister, but that means the other Shuki comes back. <laughs> Golden hour! What the fuck? What the fuck? Snake lolly. Snake lolly. So, like... Okay, let, let, let her cook. I have some theories, though. I have some theories. What are you really looking for? The snakes helped her dress up. Did you see that? They're in... Okay, so they are not looking for the DDF, but they're looking for, you know, Naon, Coco, Big Sith. So 
what is my theory here? I don't know, but they're clearly different. But they're, they, they do control Shuki too. So maybe these people are people that didn't run away, right? Of part of the Omyoji, you know, faction, they're doing the research. Maybe these are like perfected research experiments and the other people are just kind of like failures that just escaped. I don't know. Which group are you guys? Who are you? She really likes sticking out her tongue. <laughs> Hmm. We need a backstory on these people, man. Who are they? And that's the episode. All right, Nason, give it to me, Nason. Come on. Sure. Okay. Sure. Teach us Coco. Oh, oh not Nason today. Coco juice. So it's not. It's any body fluids at will. Any body fluid important. Okay. Sure, sure. All right, Deathmatch, I'll be excited. That's the next episode, but hey, that's it from me. And are you thinking what I'm thinking? I mean, I wouldn't mind if Nan would get come into me, but what did we learn today? So the peaches, right? Focus on the plot, guys. Guys, focus on the fucking plot, okay? So, so yes, Coco has built-in loot, but, but, okay, listen, listen, listen. So, I can't focus on the plot anymore. Uh, oh, the peaches, the peaches make some girls go berserk. The Omyoji faction then comes in, tries to do experiments on it, but we ran away. And the Omyoji seems kind of like an evil group that does experimentations. And the Supreme Commander seems to be aware. Tenka is not too aware. She kind of knows, but she doesn't really. So we're intentionally keep, um, keeping us from hidden. So now the good question is, who's the bad people? Are we the good guys? Are they the bad people or are the Supreme Commander and like the people that's higher up in the DDF, are they truly the bad people, right? The plot's getting very thick as we get more introductions to thick women, but that's it for me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for my content, and until next time, take care.